we'll cover how to upload a single file, upload multiple files, and see how you can use a third-party library that does the heavy lifting for you. But first, let's dive into uploading a single file in React with Fetch. To upload a single file in React with Fetch, firstly, we will create a boilerplate app that we'll use to add the file upload markup and logic. We will use Vite and TypeScript. Then, we'll create a new component called Single File Uploader in src components for his Single File Uploader TSX. Now, a user can pick a file they want to upload. When a user chooses a file, we show a summary file name, file type, and file Z of the selected file under the file input. Fetch API with its fetch method a handful method to make a request call. Form data interface to easily append files to the fetch payload will send. When we tie the file input component and the new logic we wrote into one piece of code, we select a file, view its details and click Upload a File button. Then, after some time, in the browser's console, we can view the result of the file upload request meaning our file got uploaded successfully. I created four states. Initial the upload hasn't started yet. Uploading the upload started. Success the upload finish properly. Failure the upload, unfortunately, failed. Now, we can close the browser console and view the upload state in the UI directly. Let's show how to upload multiple files. The only part that will change is the part where the user can choose multiple files to upload. Awesome, we set up everything, and now this is how multi-file upload works in React. But what if we can make that easier and if we try to use an already baked solution? UploadCare made a brand new uploader that is fully customizable. The new uploader is built with web components and part of the UploadCare Blocks components. To get started, you need to install the UploadCare Blocks with the following command and add types configuration to tsconfig JSON in the root of the project. Then, we'll create a small component for the UploadCare file uploader called UploadCare Uploader. First off, we need to import lr from at UploadCare slash blocks and call register blocks on it. This is needed so we can register the components that are going to be used in this upload care uploader react component. Now we get to the fun part. First off, we wrap everything into a section HTML element. This can be some other element of your choice and we set a CSS variable with our upload care project API key. The LR file upload regular provides the actual UI for uploading files and LR data output is there so we can track what gets uploaded and taken down by the user in the UI. As you can notice, both of these elements have the class attribute and the uploader CFG value. This is because upload care blocks are customized via CSS. We put the CSS in upload care uploader CSS and imported it at the top. Upload care will take care of the uploading for you and make it faster with its uploading network. It works like CDN. All files in this case, images are rendered in the gallery below the uploader. I hope you enjoyed and learned something from this video. Thanks for watching and catch you in the next one.